guys, it's Steve Mickey. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a Try Not To Laugh Challenge Family Guy Edition. Cutaway compilations from Season 15, Part 3, it says. I'm going to keep it stone cold. Sorry, I look tired. I just woke up. Um, I'm stone cold. Let's get to it. I'm tired. I just ruined everything. This sucks even worse than when I stubbed my toe. Why does everything bad always happen to me? Answer me, guy in box and guy on cross. And after all, it's a song for babies. Yeah, but, but that's the thing. Baby songs never tackle real baby issues. You know, like, like loud noises or teething. Or when dad uses me as a lumbar pillow. <laughs> ow. 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 This thing works better in the car. Hey, any mail for me? Yes, your death threats to Grimace have all been returned. Well, has the Shamrock Shake period been extended? I believe that's still seasonal. But while I have you, your bill remains unpaid, and we saw you selling our robes on eBay. I'm afraid we're evicting you from the hotel. What's your home address? I'm sorry, sir. Now, do you want to leave the regular way, or do you want our Uncle Phil to throw you out? I think you know what I want. Uncle Phil. Ah! <laughs> Might be a little too late for that. I kind of destroyed all the vaccines in town. in my apartment. I better get home. Now, Chris, you're getting older, so it's time for you to learn the classic pool party game, talk to somebody's wife in a bikini until they cover up uncomfortably. So, Bonnie, how are things going? Oh, things are fine. Been kind of busy lately. What with Susie starting to... Okay, bye. Damn, it's been two seconds. Hey, Peter. Hey, what have you been watching on TV lately? Oh, you know, this and that. There's a show called Shipping Wars. Yeah, it's actually kind of... Okay, bye. Look! Oh, no. I have questions. more annoying than going to an Italian restaurant with someone who's been to Italy. I call this a trattoria. More like a restaurant. Look at that fresco. It's supposed to be the hills of Elba. Not once you've seen them. Are you ready to order? See. Si. Let me handle this, Peter. Two spaghettis and a chicken fingers. So I don't have to make small talk with you or spend any money? Of course not. Here, wipe yourself off with this West Elm catalog. My God, this app is amazing! Thank you, cell phone Jesus! Huh? Oh, yeah, fine. Well, that's it. From now on, we're eating healthy around here. We're gonna feel better and we're gonna look better. Well, looking better doesn't always solve your problems, Lois. Sure didn't work for Droopy Dog when he got that facelift. Contrary to my appearance, I'm still not happy. Please study my brain so that others don't suffer as I have. juices in the hot dogs. Well, I'm sorry. I got no choice but to call for a complete muscle failure. I mean, we don't keep secrets in this house. We didn't even keep the pop secret secret. Psst, hey, did you hear? Hear what? Orville Redenbacher is gay. What? He has a son. He's in the commercial. His son's gay, too. They're both gay. They have sex parties in the Hollywood Hills. It sounds like you're just making up stories about your competitors. You're gay, too. What? <laughs> yeah, you're a psycho! Dad, you're never gonna believe what- Hush, meet Orville Redenbacher and his son. Watch. Uh, <sighs> and that's where we get the expression, gay as a bag of popcorn. 
No. I don't think that's the, that's. No. Well, I guess you're right. And I wouldn't be surprised if he ends up looking like an exact mashup of Lois and Peter. <laughs> you want to talk about the show? I'll talk about the show. The show sucks. The only reason I stay here is to maintain my profile for my startup business, discreetcrepe.com. Hi, are you a straight adult male who likes to eat crepes without people making unwanted assumptions about your private life? Go to discreetcrepe.com, place your order, and within 30 minutes... Very masculine pizza delivery for Stewie Griffin. Oh, thank you. Mmm, strawberry banana Nutella with raspberry drizzle. Well, I just need a guy's butt to eat this off of, and I got myself a knife. Don't worry, Lois, I'll get rid of it. It'll be a piece of kit, just like my penis. It was laughed there. I want it to hang down to my knees. Oh, dear. I moved up my knees. <laughs> no. We now return to how David Lynch stole Christmas. Oh, no. Hello, I got you a present. It's a thumb. <gasps> Don't look away. Let the fear wash over you. I don't understand. That's the whole point. Now, did you leave a plate of black coffee out for me? No. In the future, please leave a plate of black coffee out for me. Also in the past. Well, now I'm excited about this, Brian. I feel like an eighth grader who just had sex. So, you go all the way? Oh, yeah. I'm going to need some proof. Hmm. How can I prove it? Maybe with Father O'Leary's briefs. Oh! The king! He said he loved me. <laughs> I won again. Oh my gosh. I hope I can get through most of these videos. Oh my gosh. Okay. That is my victory <laughs> to Family Guy. Um, cut away couple episodes from season 15, part 3, it says. Oh, thank the Lord I won. <laughs> because I almost laughed with the... Um, Pete was if Stewie, Stewie was a mashup of Lois and Peter, I would have honestly would have lost to that one right away because that's my favorite, one of my favorite clips, it's one of my favorite cutaways from season fifteen. Let me know what you guys think of the video in the comments below. Like the video and don't forget to subscribe. Later, guys. Let me know what you guys think of the video in the comments below. Like the video and don't forget to I always mess up on these. Let me know what you guys think of the video in the comments below. Like the video and don't forget to I hate this.